Hello children, welcome to Narayana Live Classes. Today we are going to discuss one of the assignment number 4 and class 7th and the topic animal fiber. So let us discuss one by one question. The first question, shared skin with the hair is dipped in the water tanks and stirred with it. So options what they have given, option A hand and option B spade and option C both A and B and option D needles. So the answer it is with the spade they are going to dip that uh, the, in the water tanks. So let us write the answer option B. Okay. So the next one next question the process of washing and removing grease, dirt and the dust from the wool is called as washing, scoring and wool classing both A and B. So the answer it is washing and scoring. So we can write down that answer option D. Okay. So let us discuss the third question. The woolen threads that go in, that go side to side are so weft threads, wrap threads, woolen threads, and all the above. So these are side to side are weft threads. Option A. So let us go for that of next question. The next question: cotton is mainly it is composed of that is cellulose. So proteins, cellulose, cores, and lipid they have given. The answer it is option B cellulose. So separation of unwanted materials like uh, twigs or bits of the leaves etc that may be present in the wool is sharing, sorting and uh, wool classing option that it is both B and C. So answer it is sorting and wool classing option D it is. Match the following here what they have given big sized uh, Cane frames and pattu kayalu, mulberry silkworm and tusser silkworm and female moth. So what are the answers for these? Let us write the answers. So lays that 500 uh, eggs in one go. Whereas that a mulberry leaves and chendrikalu lays 200 eggs in one and go. And cocoon termin terminalia leaves. So what are the answers for this? We will see the options what they have given. So let us write that the options. So big sized crane frames. So what are the answers here? Big sized crane frames. Chendrikalu. So Pattukayalu. As we can call it as cocoons. Mulberry silkworm. Mulberry silkworm which feeds on that of which feeds on that of a mulberry leaves. So as we can see here, mulberry leaves. Option B. And tusser silkworm. Tusser silkworm is terminalia leaves. And female moth, which is lays that eggs 500 in one go. Okay. So the answer it is, as you can see that, CEBFA. So what is the answer? CEBFA, in which option B it is. We will write that answer. They did not given here. That is option B. So will we go for that of option B? Then match the following here. As you can see that fleece, wrap threads, and scoring, sharing they have given. Woolen threads are stretched from the top of uh, loom to the bottom. And cleaning of hair or the fleece, removing of hair or fleece, and soft mass of uh, wool. So, what is the answer for that? Fleece. So, fleece is nothing but soft mass of the wool. So, we will write that. Yes. Then the next one is wrap threads. Wrap threads are woolen threads that are stretched from the top of a loom to the bottom. So, P and the scoring. 
so what is that answer it is cleaning of a hair or the fleece the process is called as scoring then shearing then removal of the hair or the fleece which is called as shearing so we will write the answer so that S P Q R. So option D is uh, correct. Okay. So this is what uh, the assignment of a class uh, assignment of a number four and the class seventh. Okay. So we'll that's all for this assignment. Thank you.